Debbie. I am a PhD student here at the School of Forestry behind me. I am an international student and I came all the way from South Africa to study forestry uh, here at NAU. We have a really awesome program and um, yeah, join me as I show you around the School of Forestry. So I'm standing in our beautiful atrium here in the School of Forestry. In this building you will find many labs. The School of Forestry is very much an interdisciplinary department here on campus. We have physiologists, fire ecologists, wildlife scientists, entomologists, you name it. And so we can go upstairs and have a look at everybody's lab. This is the Forest Ecology Lab. This lab is managed by Dr. Pete Foulet and it is where you will find me and various other graduate students working. Um, in this lab, we primarily focus on research that integ integrates climate, forests and wildfire. We use various research techniques to do this. Um, so as you can see, we have a bunch of samples sitting on the table. Uh, these are tree cores that were sampled from southwestern United States and we um, are looking at the tree rings to compare it to climate. Uh, we also use other research techniques like um, models, which is something that I'm focusing on, um, in order to establish climate tree relationships. Um, we have quite a good team here. In fact, one of uh, these team members is our undergraduate research assistant, uh, Emma. Emma, if you'll just introduce yourself. Uh, I'm Emma. I'm a senior in the School of Forestry. Uh, I've been working here for probably a little over two years. Um, and I also had the opportunity uh, working through this lab to get a research grant to do some of my own research about Inglewood spruce. Great, so if you're interested in joining our lab team, feel free to pop in by and meet myself or Dr. Fule and we'd be happy to chat. Hi, I'm Chrissy. I'm a PhD student here in the School of Forestry and we are standing in the Forest Entomology Lab. So entomology, we study insects uh, mostly with forest health applications or broader ecological applications. So, Right now, most of us are studying some kind of insect interaction with their environment, whether it's bark beetles interacting with trees and with fungi, or ants interacting with seeds and plants around their nest, or lots of ground insects interacting with vegetation after a fire. So we have a lot of ecological applications going on. If you're really interested in entomology and studying insects, and uh, learning how they're impacting the environment, definitely get a hold of Dr. Rich Hopsetter and come see what we're all about. Hi, my name is Jose and I'm a graduate student here at the Wildlife Lab in the School of Forestry. In 2018, I joined this lab to work on bats in my home country, Nicaragua. Wildlife management is branded in an understanding of the biology of wild animals and ecosystem ecology. We study how animals use their environment to provide conservation and management approaches to protect or provide habitat. We pair field work with genetics applications in our bat ecology and genetics lab and Asian DNA lab, identifying population biology, natural and evolutionary history of organisms of all taxa under the umbrella of understanding how flora and fauna function in a natural system and are impacted in human altered ones. From endangered species like the New Mexico jumping mouse to tropical bats, our work takes us around the southwest and outside the U.S. Hello, my name is John Pilak. I'm a master's student here in the Wood Science and Biometrics Lab. Here in the lab, we have two distinct research directions. The Wood Science part of our lab focuses on modeling and measuring wood uh, properties and dynamics. We combine traditional forest measurements with x-ray densitometry and other tests of wood properties with the interest of how trees respond to both silviculture and environmental changes such as drought. We hope that this research will inform and inspire efficient wood utilization, which is essential for successful implementation of forest restoration initiatives, as well as an increased understanding of environmental controls to tree growth and wood properties. 
The Forest Biometrics part of the lab focuses on the application of advanced mathematical, computational, and statistical tools to problems spanning from modeling population dynamics to quantifying spatial patterns and species interactions. Forest Biometrics can provide a deeper understanding of the natural world and require strong analytical and creative problem-solving skills. Our specific research interests include novel quantitative approaches to answering questions regarding restoration ecology, ecosystem pattern process interactions, vegetation demographics and dyna dynamics, and emerging technologies such as big data, remote sensing, and mobile tech. Hi, my name is Lulu and I am an MS student in Dr. Kristen Waring's Silviculture and Applied Forest Health Lab. We believe that understanding how our systems are changing and reacting to novel situations is key to developing appropriate silvicultural strategies. Currently, we have projects focused on interactions between native trees, climate change, and invasive species, including the southwestern white pine, white pine blister rust, and aspen oyster shell scale systems, adapting silviculture for climate change and building forest resilience through silviculture. We also have smaller projects related to using remote sensing for silviculture prescription implementation in both ponderosa pine and pinon pine nut production. As far as I know, we have one of the most diverse faculties, both in terms of gender and ethnic diversity of any forestry school. And um, that, we need that. We need that. To, we need students to see people like them as faculty members and as mentors. And I'm really proud of that. I, I really do believe we have one of the most diverse programs in terms of our faculty. I'm Jim Allen. I'm the executive director of the School of Forestry, and I want to thank you so much for the time you spent learning about our program here. Uh, hopefully you're impressed with the range of things that you've seen, but I want to get across that this is just scratching the surface of a much deeper, more diverse program, and I'd, I'd love for you to learn more about it. I hope you have a better idea of what the School of Forestry at NAU has to offer, and we hope to see you here soon in the near future. Thank you.